we are going to learn about the food we eat food is one of our basic needs all living things need food to grow and to survive food gives us energy to work and play it also keeps us strong and protects us from various diseases food contains substances which are the building materials of our body and provide us energy for growth and other nutrients the materials that are present in our food for good health and growth are called nutrients there are five types of nutrients that our body needs they are carbohydrates fats proteins vitamins and minerals on the basis of their functions they are divided into three groups energy giving body building food and protective food carbohydrates and fats are called energy giving food proteins are called body building foods and vitamins and minerals form protective food apart from all these five nutrients roughage and water are also essential for us together with all these five nutrients and roughage and water they form components of our food now let us discuss about all the nutrients the first one is carbohydrate carbohydrates are needed by the people who do a lot of physical work like rickshawalas and athletes rice wheat maize potato are examples of carbohydrate rich food secondly we are going to come on fats fats keep our body warm fats give us more energy than carbohydrates oil nuts butter and ghee are few examples of fat rich food eating lots of fat rich food is harmful it can lead to obesity now coming on to proteins proteins uh, as we all know that it is called the body building of food they help us to grow children and body builders need more protein rich food eggs fish meat milk peas and pulses are rich in proteins vitamins and minerals vitamins and minerals they keep us healthy and fit as they protect us from various diseases fruits vegetables and milk are rich in vitamins and minerals 
विटामिन ए बी सी एंड डी आर सम एग्जाम्पल्स ऑफ विटामिन पपाया कैरेट एंड लीफी वेजिटेबल्स आर रिच इन विटामिन ए मिल्क एंड बटर आर रिच इन विटामिन डी As we all know that milk is a complete food. It contains proteins, carbohydrates, fats, vitamins and minerals. So we should drink milk. While talking about minerals, calcium, sodium, iodine potassium these are examples of certain minerals calcium makes our bones and teeth strong iron which is present in spinach helps in the formation of blood water and roughage दो वाटर एंड रफेज डू नॉट प्रोवाइड एनी न्यूट्रियट्स टू आवर बॉडी दे आर एसेंशियल फॉर हेल्दी डाइजेस्टिव सिस्टम वी ऑल नो दैट वाटर इज लाइफ वाटर इज एसेंशियल फॉर आवर बॉडी टू स्टे हेल्दी एंड वर्क प्रॉपरली वाटर ऑल्सो हेल्प्स इन द डाइजेशन ऑफ फूड That's why we must drink six to eight glasses of water every day. About three fourth of our body weight is water. Roughage is the fiber present in our food. It cannot be digested, but it helps to remove the undigested food. from our body it is important for proper functioning of our digestive system whole grains brown rice salads fruits and vegetables are rich in fibers we are what we eat which means that if we eat healthy nutritious food we will be healthy and happy if we eat more of junk food like pizza burgers we will remain unhealthy and weak so to remain healthy we must eat food that contains all the nutrients in the right amount the food we eat is called our diet and a diet which has all the nutrients in right amount is called a balanced diet rice and bread must form a greater part of the daily diet including this all seasonal fruits and vegetables must be taken in good amount protein rich food should be taken equally a balanced diet helps in proper functioning of our body oil ghee and butter too should be taken in little amount now this is all about your nutrients and balanced diet now we should have a quick recall of what we have learned let's work on few questions this is an assignment in which you have to name at least two food sources each of carbohydrates vitamins iron roughage and minerals now when we 
answer the food sources for carbohydrates you have got the option of potato and rice papaya and carrot are rich in vitamin a iron is present in spinach and dates and salads fruits are rich in fiber fibers milk and fruits are rich in minerals that's all for today we'll continue this topic in our next video thank you